Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How's everyone doing? Let me know down below. And in our video today, we're doing a large Ulta haul. Went a little crazy with concealers and foundations. So let's take a look. I'm gonna go dump this out on my desk right now. Whoops. All right, then I'm gonna separate everything by brands. And then we'll start talking about the products that I got. Sorry if you hear trucks in the background. I live on a pretty busy street. I'm still separating. I got a good amount of things here for us to go over. I'm ready to go. We're going to start off with the biggest group of products and that is from Too Faced and I got their Too Faced Born This Way Matte Foundation. I did get three shades. The one shade is actually packed away in my suitcase as I am traveling to Niagara Falls, New York this Thursday with my boyfriend. We wanted to go to Niagara Falls, Canada, but they did not open up the border in time. So, maybe we'll try another year. It's okay. So, I got the shade Vanilla, which is packed away. I have Porcelain, which is like my winter, winter shade. And I have Warm Nude, which is my summer shade. I got two concealers from Too Faced Born This Way. I got Porcelain and Vanilla. I really like their regular foundation, which is what I'm wearing today. I do like that. And they had another concealer, but it looks like they discontinued it. It was a hydrating concealer. It was smaller than this one here. I'm really upset that they did discontinue it because I really do like it. I got four of their powders. One color is already packed away, and that is the vanilla one. I have porcelain, I have light beige, and I have natural beige, and the reason why I have all these colors is because I fluctuate in color as the season goes on. The next ones I'm going to be talking about are the e.l.f. Camo Found CC Cream Foundations. I got two different colors because when I did the fi shade finder, it said that I was Fair 120N, and it actually looks really light for me. So I picked up the next one, which is light 210N. So even if this is too dark, I can at least mix in some of this and get my perfect shade. I picked up the hydrating camo concealer to go along with it. I've been hearing a lot of great things. By watching YouTubers trying this out. So I figure I'll give this a whirl. Two other products from e.l.f. that I got was another YouTube favorite. Which is the e.l.f. Primer Infused Blush. And I got it in Always Rosy. It's a really pretty color. You can use it summer, fall, winter, all seasons. I got the Ride or Die Lip Balm from e.l.f. I got it in Just Peachy. It's good to keep your lips hydrated, especially since we're wearing masks now. Our lips are getting dry. I also wanted to try the Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation that I've also been hearing great things about. I got the color 31NN and it does seem a little light. I did I uh, swatch all of these foundations so we'll see if not I'll just go up a, si a cup not a size a color <laughs> moving on I think this is my last foundation set here I got the color prop excuse me color pop pretty fresh pretty fresh hydrating foundation I got this in only one color in light 5 nn 
And to go with that, I also got the creamy concealer from ColourPop. And I got that in just light... Ugh, I can't talk today. In light 40N. We'll see if how that works. And to finish off those products, I got the, hydrate, the ColourPop Hydrating Mist Setting Spray. I hear pretty good things about this. But my all-time favorite setting spray is the Morphe setting spray. But I got minis. So I got one, two, three, four. So I tried to get the full-size ones, but they were sold out. So I got the minis. that will hold me off until they get the full-size ones in stock. Plus, I need to put one in my travel bag. But I've been waiting to film this video. The last thing I got is pretty big on TikTok, and it is the NYX Marshmallow Primer. I don't use primer, really, but this looked kind of fun, and I just like the name, so I figured I'd give this a try. And I really honestly think that this is everything I got from Ulta. So, I think we're going to wrap up the video here. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment before you leave. And until next time, have a great day. Thanks. Bye.